We did mention just a couple things. A lot more to talk about. So we're going to be live all morning long. In fact, we have team coverage. We have Brady Halbleib because one of the important things, we're underneath the roof right now. Outside, it feels pretty nice. But what's going to happen later? What are the contingencies? Annie Brown, our weather uh, meteorologist, has been talking about that. Brady, what are contingencies when it comes to weather? Let's get over to you. Hey, good morning, Justin. Yeah, so um, it's pretty clear right now, but what um, Tulsa police are actually concerned about the traffic that's going to be around this area because this year is the first year that, that they're, they're not going to be using a shuttle to be taking people in and out of the park. So they are concerned about more traffic to be in the neighborhood surrounding the fair. So um, if you take a look at this map here on your screen, um, uh, that's the paid parking that's highlighted the, in the blocks on the south and uh, east and the west perimeters. Um, there will be no fair parking on the north end on the 15th Street side. But if you decide to park outside of the park, um, they're asking people to pay close attention to signage. They're also asking drivers to not block anyone's driveway. They say they just won't ticket you. They also will tow your car. In addition, as people are excited to get back to the fair, TPD is urging drivers to be cautious of pedestrians on the road, specifically to keep an eye out for children running in the street. And as always, leave your car locked and remove all the loose chains from the cup holders there. Now, if you do prefer to park inside of the fair, there are uh, fees, 10 to $20. There's gonna be um, a map that we'll have on our website so you can check out to see where you would like to park. And of course, everyone has been talking about the weather and how it's gonna impact the fair and the weekend as well. So with that, we're gonna send it on over to meteorologist Annie Brown with all of your answers. Annie.